And with that, we are done with this course. Making a server and a client communicate with each other isn't that hard. But doing it correctly, efficiently, and securely is a much more complex task than it might seem. We have covered a lot of topics in this course. We've taken a look at the request and response cycle, where the browser and the server get connected with each other. Then we looked at HTTP's verbs, headers, REST, and performance issues. Lesson 3 was on HTTPS, TLS, and cryptography. In the last lesson, we looked at HTTP2 and all the amazing benefits it brings to the web ecosystem. In this lesson, we looked at security precautions with the same origin policy, way to get around that policy, and then some vulnerabilities like CSERF and cross-site scripting. We covered a lot of techniques, but the important thing to keep in mind throughout all of this is keeping your users secure. Thanks for joining us on this journey of client-server communication. We'll see you later. Bye.